So I friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational videos. So here I will provide you a very important information and good news for all the students of JEMS 2022. As you all know the number of students who registered for the phase 2 that is July attempt has been released by the NTA. That is only 6,29,778 and in previous attempt there was only 7,70,000 around a student appeared. Registration was done around 8.5 lakh but the uh, student who appeared in the examination and you will be having the competition with those student who have appeared in the examination. So this time also I think the appearing student will be around 5.5 or 5.6 lakh only because uh, lots of student will not able to appear in the examination due to uh, due to some personal reason. So the important thing is that what will be the num or number of unique uh, student and if it is less this time what is the benefit of that and what is the loss of that. So I think there is no loss and you will be getting the benefit only. Uh, now if you talk about the exact number, what will be the unique student? So it will be around 8 to 8.2 lakh because this time in phase 2, of, of course, the number of a student is less. But there are some unique students who register for the first time. Personally, I know lots of students who are uh, doing the tweets again and again for the opening of uh, registration for phase 2 again. So uh, NTA also provided, you also know, NTA provided the window for application for uh, July attempt again. So my, many students have registered for the first time. So I think it will make the unique student around 8.2 uh, 8 lakh or 8 lakh also. It can be 7.9 also. I can't predict 100% correct, but I am providing you the uh, assumption. So based on that, I have already provided the percentile versus category rank because that will have complete effect from the number of a student because based on a percentile, you will be getting good rank. If, you, if the number of a student will be less. So I have already provided the percentile versus category rank. It is general EWS, OBC, SC, ST rank. So please try to watch that video in the i button as well as the description box. You will get the link. And more importantly now, the important information is that for every student, uh, the minimum percentile required for NIT, triple IT, GFTI will be decreased. And also in JE Advanced, you will have to score a little bit less marks as compared to previous year to get the same IIT and very soon I will try to provide you that information in the same channel that is num a number of marks that you need to score for each IIT for CSE branch and other branches also and very soon I will try to provide you the updated minimum percentile required for NIT, triple IT, GFTI for top 5, top 10, top 20 everything you will be getting but uh, but I am assuring you that you will be getting the same college with less percentile this year so nothing to worry you are uh, this year a little bit less competition will be there so this is the good news for you so please try to focus on your studies at the last time of the uh, examination if you will get a little bit more percentile it will help you a lot this time so this was the information about the effect of number and less number of a strength this year in JE mains examination it will clearly have effect on everything but of percentile also will be decreased for JE advanced examination that also have discussed in the previous video so please try to subscribe the channel that's what i can request you because i will be guiding you for everything up to your admission is done and you will be getting all the updated information here in the same channel and if you want the complete guidance from me you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number at the time of counseling process so that i will be guiding you and i will be available for you every time from 10 am up to midnight and also i will be guiding you for other counseling whatever you will do based on JE means rank or other entrance exam rank so if you want you can contact me that time so thanks again for watching this video please try to subscribe so now I would like to introduce the Philo app where you can get the solution of all your question, doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to J or NEET or boards examination. Then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps. That is first you have to download the Philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app. And after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the India's best educator. In question you want to say that bulb ki power is if the bulb is वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट right? इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220 तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहां पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो ऐप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड IEB001 यू विल गेट द 10% इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट